it's not always easy finding something to wear in the summertime. If you're not into shorts, but it's too hot to wear pants, a skirt can be your best asset, according to my first guest this morning. In today's Style File, we are sharing five different skirt styles and the tips, the advice on how to wear them. Studio 5 Style and Fashion contributor Casey Matheny is here with her best advice. And does this start with a sort of, we hate shorts? We hate shorts. We hate shorts. Have you ever found a good pair of shorts? No, I don't think I've worn shorts actually in since like fifth grade. They're terrible. So. So yes, we're gonna keep cool in the summer, we're gonna look good, and it's not going to be pants. Thank you. We've, we've gotta stay cool, we've gotta move, but I think the key is kind of the casuality of it because totally. we feel sometimes too fussy, too dressed up in a skirt, but you say it can be dressed down. Absolutely dressed down. There's so much versatility in each of these skirts and dressing it down is like a big option. All right, I can almost already hear the email coming in for this first skirt because it is <gasps> darling. Yes. This pink summer gingham. This has been like the it skirt of the summer. It's off of Amazon. It's $34.99. What? Comes in a number of colors. I chose this because I feel like gingham can look a little picnicky at times, mm -hmm. and this takes it out of that. It's mature. It totally is. Um, one thing, a tip when wearing a longer skirt mm -hmm. is to make sure that you can always see your ankles. Oh. Because if not, it looks like circa 2009 with like the jersey skirts like dragging on the ground. <laughs> yeah. You know this, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so you want to see a little ankle. It just looks more flattering on your body and it elongates your legs. Um, so that's one little tip for our midi max. Nothing against our ancestry. I'm struggling yes. this morning. But does that also keep it out of the pioneer box a little bit? Oh, the, for sure. Because the longer, especially the tiered, I think can tip a little pioneerish sometimes. 1,000%, okay. which is kind of like the way of fashion right now, like yeah, the pioneer. And, and, and so, yes, you can modernize that skirt for sure. Show the ankle. Yes. We have okay. to stop and talk about this t-shirt because a good polished t-shirt is hard to find. This yeah. girl has structure. Yes. Okay. So this is from COS, C-O-S. It's the most amazing store ever. ever. It's um, a lot of basics that are just nicer, uh -huh. right? So you've got your white tee. It just looks nicer. I love that with the polished neckline mm -hmm. and you can tell it's substantial. Mm -hmm. Like she'll hold up with me. Absolutely. I'm going to be getting me one of those. Yes. All right. Next we have, is it a denim skirt? Yes. So this is actually a denim Cute. paper bag waist. This is also off of Amazon and there were 35 different colors, like 10 different types of denim and washes. I love the white because once again, it is a casual denim skirt, but it just looks a little more elevated. Yeah. Um, and you could wear it with a basic tee. You could also throw on, I mean, like sneakers, sandals, whatever. How do we feel about the paper bag silhouette on maybe a more curvy body or someone who has maybe a thicker midsection? This skirt is going to be flattering on every body type because number one, it is going to accentuate a waist, whether you have it or not. Visually, <laughs> it just creates a waist. Oh, good. And then you can see how it flares out. So if you feel like you're hippie or you carry your weight in your hips, mm -hmm. it's going to flare out. So you're not going to know where your hips begin or end. Love that. It gives you the waist and flares out. Hello. we're kind of, she's, Casey's a magician, an illusionist. Mm -hmm. She's got all of the resume boxes checked. I'm here for all of you. This next skirt, a little more dressy, but gosh, I love that print. Yeah, so this is a tiered midi skirt, uh -huh. and this tiering like this, like actual ruffles, mm -hmm. is very current right now. Um, when you're wearing a skirt like this, it is a little bit more, it can lean a little bit more dressy, but once again, it just depends on how you pair it. Like, we're pairing with the tee and sandals, and right away you're like, I could wear this all day. Totally. It becomes an all-day, everyday outfit. Yeah. How do you choose the color of t-shirt when you do have a little bit more of a busy, splashy print like that? Yeah, so one tip that I like to follow is that when you have a pattern that you're like, I don't know what to do, mm -hmm. choose one of the minor colors out of it. The less obvious. The less obvious, mm -hmm. and pair it with that, and it just brings a little bit more dimension to the outfit. Mm -hmm. So I chose this purple, which is in here in these little tri or, um, diamonds. Barely there. Barely there. But it becomes almost, it, it's, a, it's the stylist effect is what it is. I mean, we would go typically for maybe the more obvious red, yeah. the more obvious little teal, but you went for the less, the lesser their color and it becomes this incredibly curated, just high end outfit. Yeah. I had a friend teach me once too, if you look at the inside of the tag and it's lined with mm -hmm. a certain color, that's another way to pull in kind of that offset. Yeah. All right, this Absolutely. next look is so darling and suddenly yes. I just want to be a t-shirt girl. Look how cute that is. I know, okay, so these tennis skirts are not just for the court, okay. but for the sidewalk as well. <laughs> um, and once again, you don't have to wear like a workout tank with this. You can add a t-shirt and now you can wear it all day. 
All right, now pleats present sometimes a problem in my mind. Like, oh, yeah. where should they hit? How should they fall? What's the style one, two on that? Yeah, so pleats can be really tricky. I always, no matter the skirt, like to look for a really emphasized waistband. Okay. That is going to lay flat here. Good, And yes. then the pleats come out. Okay, so, so we you want can tuck it in. And hold, it's flat. Hold in my bits right here. Yes. yes. And then hold let it, it fall from there. And also, because it's a tennis skirt, you've got the little side pockets here. So you can put your phone, other accessories, Look whatever you need. I'm yeah, we all like pockets. I don't have a tennis racket, but I have a cell phone. <laughs> and my tennis skirt can uh -huh. help me hold uh -huh. it. Yep. All right, this probably is my favorite of the bunch just because the ribbing, I think, would be so flattering, yeah? Oh, yeah. I mean, you've got the vertical stripes, uh -huh. and it's just a beautiful, moving, like, it's a jersey. It's yes. a jersey rib skirt. Stretch with me, jersey. Um, with something like this, once again, it's all about proportions. So if you are getting tighter on bottom, you want to be more flowy on top. You don't want to pair a really tight top with this or it's just gonna feel like you know, so yeah. we've got this oversized tee that we've knotted at the waist. Yeah, I love it. Why are you? I love it when Casey <laughs> starts making sound effects. I mean, it's it's emphatic. It, it, we we know how she feels. Okay, <laughs> exactly. Like you get it. <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. So we knotted at the waist, so once again, you can get that waist, yeah. but still keep those proportions in check. This is cute, and no one would look at any of these outfits and think she's trying too hard, which I no. think is an insecurity when we pull out a skirt on a Monday through Friday. Absolutely. Yeah, you want you want it to look and feel easy. That's the point. You helped us do that. Casey, thank you so much. Where can we get more of your brilliant style advice? <gasps> oh, come over to my Instagram at Casey Matheny Style. I've got lots of styling tips and tricks and reels just to make styling yourself easier. And one thing to love about this girl, there's many things. She's helping us navigate the Amazon just as she is the Nordstrom sale. Like there's good fashion mm -hmm. to be found at any price point. Yeah. I appreciate you help us do that. One to 10, how are you feeling about the Nordy sale this year? You know what? There are the staples that I am stocking up on for sure. Sure, sure. okay, the yeah. business. Yeah, yeah. She'll hook you up there too with what to sort through and shop. Thank you so much, great job.